Hello. Do I recognize you? You've visited our candy shop before, haven't you? Okay, well, it's very good to see you again. What are you looking for today? Okay, so you're looking to try something new again. Great. And how were the previous snacks and treats that you picked up? You enjoyed them. Excellent. Well, it is a brand new year and we have started supplying products from different companies, so I am sure that you will find something that you will like today. Mm-hmm. We have products from Fox's British Biscuits. We have a French uh, pineapple juice brand that just came in. We have lots of different German chocolates that came in. We have some Hershey's products. We have a lot of different things to choose from. Sounds good. Okay. So what are you looking for? Sweets, chocolates, drinks, maybe some savory snacks? Sweets in particular and chocolate. Okay. Well, I did prepare a sampler. If you'd like to have a look at it and feel free to try everything on the plate if you'd like to. Sure. So here's the plate. You can just see that. Just show you about these M&Ms flying off. We have quite a few samples for you to try from today. I'll let these M&Ms just slide down. There we go. So this over here is a British Cadbury chocolate. This is a milk chocolate orange bar. Over here we have sugar cookie M&Ms. I think you might have had these before. You have. Well, we have those in stock. We have a Hershey's Kiss, but in the flavour Cherry Cordial. This is a limited edition flavour. Up here we have a German brand called Schogetten. And that is a Biscoff collaboration with the chocolate brand. Lovely and delicious. Over here we have the very famous brand Milka. And this is a bar. Feel free to have the whole thing. This is called a Milkiness. And that is a milky, creamy scented chocolate. And up here to break up the theme of chocolate. Up here we have a bar called Fritty. And I'll show you that in a little bit more detail. So there's the sample plate. Feel free to try from that anything you like as I show you the chocolates and candies, okay? So this is a fruity bar and this is a fruit flavoured bar that is very popular in European countries such as Germany. You may also find this in your local Lidl or Aldi depending on where you come from. So this is the Fritty Bar. This is a slightly chewy bar and it is very juicy and flavoursome and it is packed with vitamins. But I will show you, but I will show you it in the packaging here. This is the Fritty Bars and as you can see this is my sample bag for you today. It comes with quite a few bars in there and it comes in a variety of flavours. We stock three flavours. We have wild berry, strawberry, and raspberry, and they're all decorated very pretty. So, judging from the samples, is there anything that you'd like to maybe learn a little bit more about in greater detail? The fruity bars, sure. So this is a product of Germany, and as you can see here, it comes with a total of one, two, three, four, five, six bars included in this. This is more of a lovely, easy to snack on, on the go sort of sweet, and because it is juicy and full of vitamins, it feels a little bit healthier. It's still a candy, but it does taste a little bit more healthier because you can really taste those fruit juices coming through. The wild berry includes the flavours blackberry, blueberry and raspberry. 
it's definitely my favorite out of the three just because all of those flavors come through in it. So this does contain 0.5% fruit juice, which is quite low, but you can really taste it. And it also contains vitamin C. So this is just a really nice, fun looking style snack. I'll show you the other flavors. This is decorated in a gorgeous purple design with this cheerful fellow with three eyeballs on the front. The next one is another character design by Fritti. This is the sweet strawberry flavor and as you can see this has more of a feminine design. It's pink with long eyelashes and lipstick and they appear to be devouring many strawberries. Looking at the fruit juice content on this one, it remains the same at 0.5% and includes vitamin C again. So there's that one. This is a lovely compact style of packaging and you can pick at these as you please. Flavor-wise, this is slightly similar to a Frutella bar and it's about as chewy as such. It is a little bit different to typical fruit juice candies such as Frutella though because it is a thin strip rather than a thick cube. Mm -hmm. You're enjoying that one? Very good. The third flavor that I have for you is the raspberry flavor. This also contains 0.5% raspberry juice with vitamin C. And this is decorated in a deeper pink color with a character wearing these glasses and they have almost purple eyes as they chew away on these delicious raspberries. So, what do you think of that item? Would you be interested in purchasing that item today? You like the sound of the strawberry and the wild berry. Perfect. So I'll grab the strawberry for you now, put that on the side, and then I will get you a full size wild berry fritty product. I'll use the sample for later. So is there anything else from the plate that has interested you today? The Shogetan chocolate bar? Okay, let's see where that is. So Shogetan is an extremely popular and fairly cheap chocolate brand from Germany, but they are absolutely delicious. So this is Shogetan's collaboration with the very famous Lotus Biscoff product, which I believe originates from Belgium. So what this chocolate has done is it takes its very typical, very thin, but very creamy milk chocolate exterior and encased inside it is the traditional crunch of the Biscoff product with a caramel cream inside. It's not runny or drizzly like a typical caramel. It is a solid, but it is very easy to chew. I will personally and honestly say that whilst this is a delicious, slightly spiced, biscuity, caramel-based product, it is not quite the same as your traditional Biscoff products. If you are unfamiliar at all with Biscoff, Biscoff is a um, slightly spiced cinnamon nutmeg spiced based biscuit that a lot of people like to have with tea. So this is their collaboration with them. Mm -hmm. So what did you think of the sample of this one? You're not sure on this one? Okay. Well, what did you think of the chocolate? You like the chocolate? Good. Because we actually have four flavors in total of Shogetan products here. Shogetan make lots and lots of different wonderful flavors to choose from. They are very popular internationally and you will find them in British and American Aldi stores. 
but Germany, as it is the home of this very wonderful chocolate, does tend to have more flavours than its neighbours. So here's the first one that I'll show you out of the other three. This is Schorgetten's Kinder Bar. So if you've ever had a Kinder product, you will know that it has this milky but solid cream consistency to it. This is for people who really like a nice milk chocolate but want the flavour of real milk included in it. This is very delicious and the balance of the milk cream with the milk chocolate on this one is particularly delicious. You'll take this one. Very good. And the next one that is extremely popular at our shop is Shogetan's Yogurt and Strawberry Bar. So a lot of brands really like to fuse together the slight crunchiness of fruit pieces, as you can see here, with that same similar milk cream in the previous bar, and they'll fuse those together with a milk chocolate. The flavours of this one are reminiscent of a chocolate covered strawberry, but it has a lot of texture to keep the chocolate interesting from those fruity pieces inside the chocolate bar. This is also very elegantly decorated. And another thing I must mention is, I'm sure you could tell from this more sample you tried, but these all come individually pieced inside this bar. So it's not a connected bar. Every single piece is individual, so you don't need to break it off. One of the reasons for this is, as you may have noticed in the difference between the dairy milk chocolate bar and the Shogetan chocolate bar, is that the Shogetan pieces are much taller and they're rounded with a slight ramp to the chocolate piece, so you couldn't connect them even if you tried. But they are so delicious. These are excellently priced and they are packed full of flavour, as all German chocolates I would say are. This one sounds good too. Excellent. This is definitely a personal favourite and I really hope that you enjoy that one. And the last one, you'll have to forgive me because I'm not particularly sure on the pronunciation but I do know what's included in this one. So this is a beautifully decorated bar of Shoget and this is the Stracciatella flavour. I believe this is based off of the Italian gelato combination of milky gelato with milk chocolate shavings. You'll see this combination of flavours with this name fused into a lot of famous candy products and chocolate products, such as Lindt, for example. So as you can see, in contrast to the other chocolate bars that we've had a look at from the Shogetan brand, this one actually has a white chocolate top to it, and it has these little textured pieces encased inside, but right at the bottom it has a very thin lower edge, I believe, of a dark chocolate. So it's going to have lots of different flavour combinations of different chocolate flavours included in this one. I will personally say I am not personally familiar with this particular flavour, but it has been very popular at our shop, and it certainly is a nice, interesting, slightly unusual flavour combination that you would not particularly often see on the shelf. You like this one? Excellent. I can never fault the Shoget brand. They always pack their chocolates full of flavour, and they're so delicious, and they're snack-sized, you can feel free to eat as much of it as you want in one sitting, or take it with you as you go. I think that's a wonderful part of the Shogetan brand. Excellent. So, was there anything else on the sample plate that you tried that sounded interesting? The Hershey Cherry Cordial, yes. So let me show you that. So this is our smallest size. So this is the Hershey Kisses Cherry Cordials. 
as mentioned, this is a limited edition flavour and will only be around in the winter season. As you can smell even from the packaging alone, this oozes that gorgeous traditional alcohol reminiscent but not alcohol based cherry cordial flavour. This flavour is very typical and pairs beautifully with milk chocolate or dark chocolate. But from what you tried today, you'll know that it was a milk chocolate, yes. So there are other very famous brands that love to work with cherry cordial, such as Sella Cherries. Those have a real cherry in the middle. Those are lovely in milk and dark chocolate. But these are lovely little treat-sized famous Hershey Kisses with the beautiful cherry cordial flavour. It is incredible how they pack so much flavour inside the little Hershey's Kiss. But it is a, it is a wonderful smooth flavour. It's not particularly sweet or sickly, but it does have that nice, typical, traditional cherry cordial flavour. It's also beautifully decorated on the exterior. You have these winter themes of snowflakes, and the Hershey's Kiss itself is decorated in this red wrapper with a twin set of cherries decorated over the front. You like these? Excellent. I think that this is a wonderful choice and I'm very glad that you liked the sample from that. Great. So it appears that you have a few things left. You have the sugar cookie M&Ms, the orange chocolate Capri, and you have the milk and milkini on there. Which did you perhaps like? Okay, so pass on the milkini because you want to take the Kinder Sugarten, okay? And pass on the sugar cookie M&Ms because you've had those before, okay? So we're left with the winter orange chocolate from the sample plate. You like that one? Okay. So I'll show you the original packaging of this one. This is our smallest and only size that we have available for the winter orange edition of the British Cadbury flavour. So this, as you taste it, is a small cubed chocolate bar with the traditional flavours of Cadbury. This is infused with the traditional milk chocolate delicious flavours of Cadbury. However, it also invites in the new flavour of orange crunch. This is a lovely flavoured chocolate bar and I will say it doesn't quite pack as much of a punch as the traditional orange crunch chocolates that you would find in quality streets. That pieces tend to be more emphasised with the orange flavour. But for those who are looking for a bit more of a textured chocolate and the orange flavour is a little bit more subdued, this might be for you. This actually does contain real apple juice and also contains some pineapple fibres and apple puree, which is very interesting. That might explain why the flavours are slightly subdued with this one. Maybe the other fruits are pushing it down slightly, but there is still 4.5% orange juice included in this chocolate bar, which is remarkable that it's able to do that and not taste too much like juice or too sickly at all. So, what did you think of this one? You liked this one? Excellent. And will you be taking this one today? Perfect. Okay, so... Let's see, is there anything else that you would like to look at today? A new drink, okay. Well, we actually just got a shipment in from France of this particular drink. This is Tropico. You will find this scattered all around France and Belgium. Uh, this is a pineapple and orange flavoured juice product. This is very refreshing and very tasty. It's had the beautiful decoration of its traditional parrot on the front here. And as you can see, the flavours are represented on the front, right there. 
This is a very famous standard product that you would typically purchase in France and Belgium and it has been around since 1983 in those particular countries. However, we got in a shipment this month from the Tropico brand. This is very light, this is very refreshing. This is honestly a little bit more of a summer drink, but for those looking for a juice-packed fizzy drink, this is for you. I believe the brand was actually bought by Coca-Cola just a few years ago, so they must be doing something right to pique their interest. How does this sound to you? This sounds good. Excellent. I'll be sure to put this one on the side for you. Okay, is there anything else that you would like to have a look at today? A couple more German products if we have them? Let me have a look. We do have one new flavour in, if this interests you. So have you ever heard of the German chocolate brand Ritter? You have. Have you tried any of them? Yes. What did you think? They are wonderful, aren't they? So this is, I believe, a German product. This is Ritter Sport. And they always come in these small, compact, square packaging styles. And they're always beautifully decorated. They very much like to represent all of the colours of the rainbow. And this is their cranberry nut flavour that they released for the Christmas season. This is thick pieces of milk chocolate and as you can see from the front here it is completely stuffed with cranberry and nuts. The chocolate is still very smooth and tasty and combines all of those flavours so well and with all German chocolate. If you feel here on the back you just glide your fingers over it you can actually feel all of the nuts and cranberries protruding from the chocolate. That's how full this chocolate bar is. They spare no room and you will certainly get all of those delicious flavours combined with this one. Cranberry nuts and milk chocolate is a wonderful combination and loved by many. I really think that you'll like this one. Yeah, take this. Excellent. So that's all of the new German chocolates that we have in. But is there anything else that might interest you? Mm-hmm. A biscuit of some kind? Do we have biscuits in? Oh, you know, we do have one. You might like this one. So this is from our sample plate as well. But this is Fox's Biscuits. And have you heard of the Fox's Biscuit brand? Okay, so Fox's Biscuits are a rich, thick biscuit. People will often gift a box set of different Fox's flavours at Christmas time to their loved ones. But they have released this flavour which is delicious. Absolutely delicious. This is perfect as a standalone product or you can enjoy this with a cup of tea. But this is a milk chocolate shortcake biscuit flavoured with raspberry. This has always been my personal favourite biscuit that's been put in the Fox's Christmas collection. To my knowledge, this is a limited edition product that was only provided to Asda for their Tickled Pink Breast Cancer Awareness Campaign. And we have received a small shipment of them and I would highly recommend these. These have a beautiful buttery creamy shortcake biscuit to them with a very delicate lining of raspberry. I don't believe you will have tried, if you haven't tried these already, a raspberry flavour like this before. It feels real but not juicy. It feels like a lovely accompaniment to the chocolate and biscuit. It's delicate but it's very delicious. The good part of it being a slightly more delicate flavour of raspberry, so should you wish to do the typical tradition of combining it with a hot cup of tea, it still pairs really well. 
So I absolutely would have to recommend these to you today if this is something that you're interested in. You'll take this one as well? Excellent. I'll be sure to get to you a full size strip of those. So, do you have any other chocolates in mind that sound interesting to you today? Are you looking for a little bit of a gift box of chocolates? Okay, so we do have this one in. We have Belgium chocolate. So, I will say that this is a new product to us, and this is a very popular Gullion product. This is a Belgian brand, and have you ever heard of Gullion? You have? Do you like them? Okay, so this is a gift box of chocolates that we have just gotten in, and this contains 16 chocolates with 8 different flavours, so you get 2 of each flavour combination in here. So if you are familiar with the Gullion brand, you will know that Gullion likes to fuse milk chocolate, white chocolate, and a praline filling into their chocolates. Um, their chocolate always feels very rich, high quality, but very much still melt in the mouth. Gullion has always famously also worked with Project Seahorse, which works to work for marine conservation, which is why a lot of their shapes in their traditional products are of seashells and seahorses, which is always a nice added little bonus to their chocolates. But this is a different product that they sell, which focuses on flavours branching out from their traditional praline filling. This is the Opus collection, and I'll tell you a little bit about it, see if the flavours interest you. I can't say that I've tried these myself, but I do know that they are very popular here at our shop. So the first flavour they have is pear and mango ganache. They also have original praline, roasted hazelnut, smooth truffle, crunchy biscuit and vanilla cream, truffle, roasted hazelnut, original praline, soft caramel, and cappuccino cream. And I'll show you, right on the back here, all of the chocolates. Oh, these beautiful, unique shapes. They're very much strayed away from the traditional designs of the seahorses and seashells, and invited in these other very unique, pretty designs. This makes for an excellent gift for someone or for yourself. This is beautifully decorated with all of these lovely colours, with this traditional orange embossing and glossy style to the text here. I love the designs of the chocolates, they're a little bit unique and not traditional. A lot of different chocolate gift boxes tend to follow a very similar theme with each of their flavours, but really appreciate the details in this one. This is a mask style. This one's a dome shape with two sticks here, like a drum almost. This is a heart shape here. This is a white moon here. A triple striped white one here. The letter G with depth to it. Just beautiful. What do you think of this one? Sounds good. Excellent. I really do think it's good that the Gullion brand strayed away from its traditional flavour but also kept just enough of their traditional flavours encased in that particular Opus gift box to keep those that still like the original flavour happy. So is there anything else that you are looking for today? No? Okay. Well, I think you've got a wonderful collection of sweet chocolates, drinks, and biscuits to try from. There should be a very lovely experience digging into these. Okay, well, I will bring these up to the front so that you can pay. But I'd like to say thank you very much for visiting our shop again and trying out those delicious candies, chocolates, biscuits, and drinks. It's been very nice seeing you again. Take care. Goodbye.